good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel today's video is gonna be jordan's first day of daycare so we are prepping everything right now well i say we but i am prepping everything right now her dad is in bed sleeping <laughs> Um, I'm not gonna do him like that though. He did help me prep last night a little bit. I am getting all of her things packed up and ready. I've been going crazy with my label maker, labeling everything, and I'm going to feed her this morning, and then we are going to get her dressed and take her to school. I'm so sad, but I'm happy because she needs to go. I'm starting a new job. I have school, so you know it's it's necessary. <laughs> but yeah, that's my intro, my little check-in. Thanks for tuning in. <laughs> I just wanted really quickly to show everything that I have pulled out to set up for Boo Boo's first day tomorrow. They sent me a pack list with all these things. So I just pulled out her stuff. Um, of course, pulled out my good old trusty pal, the labor maker, label maker. Um, I just did some super cute and simple teacher gifts. And then I just made these really cute tags with Kimba. I printed, I made these on Canva and printed these, just some note sheets to like, oh, random piece of hair, postpartum shedding, if you know, you know. Anyway, um, just printed some really cute um, notes that I made on Canva as well, just so that I can give this information to the teachers for the first couple of weeks until they have us like in the system. I got noodles over here and then these, um, I got these bag tags to put on her backpack and then these to store like all of her change of clothes in, aquaphor to go to school with her, and then food to send to school, like all these. These are our favorite. I honestly really like these um, way more than Gerber, um, but these are super nice. Um, and then I they wanted an all about me form so I decided to make something cute I just covered up our, our phone numbers here but I just thought it was cuter to print it off like this and wrote down some things about her that I felt like they should know um, to kind of help them get through the day I also got her this really cute backpack I seriously can't believe that this was at Walmart um, it was only $5 so I think I'm gonna get it monogrammed across the top up here and this can be like more so her big girl bag. But she also has um, that really cute diaper bag from the hat brand. Um, so I'll send this, let's see. Like right. this really cute diaper bag. All her food is right here that I bought. But um, literally, and then they had these super cute tags so i tagged it here because i can't get this embroidered or anything and i didn't want to put vinyl on it so that we could use it for the next baby in a, like years from now but yeah i just thought this was super cute so i may send this one on the first day or um that other one that i just showed that other one is more like a big girl bag that i feel like can be used for years and years but this one is really cute and just a super cute diaper bag i've already kind of put some things in here and labeled some things that's her sleep machine her sleep sack um and then labeled it with her name and everything like that but just wanted to show those quick updates but i'll check in in the morning and yeah yours holding her bottom like a big girl okay. we're getting in the car all right so we got everything packed up we are in the car will drove separate um so that he can leave and go right to work after we drop her off but oh my goodness i i don't know how to feel like i'm happy for her like I mean, obviously she's a baby, but I just think it's so good for kids to be around other kids and build those social skills and like, you know, so on and so forth. But yeah, I don't know how to feel. Obviously, like for the past, like 
five and a half, six months or so, she has spent every day at home with me with the exception of Tuesdays and Thursdays when I have like gone to class and she stayed with my mom for a few hours, but even that has been hard for me. So I don't know. I feel like this is going to be something. Like I just don't know. I don't know. I'm nervous. I really hope that they're like sweet her. I mean, obviously, like I wouldn't take her about anything. They were nice to her or whatever. But I'm just so nervous, and like I'm so nervous. I wanted her to be at least one, but it just didn't work out that way for me to wait a whole year to send her to school um, or to daycare, whatever. I call it school. Other people insist that it's daycare. I feel like whatever. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just. I'm happy but I'm sad but like I said this vlog is just me literally documenting the day and like documenting my feelings about everything so yeah I'm just but yeah that's my little check-in for now and hopefully boo boo has a good day I will be watching her on the camera literally so much I'm not even gonna lie I can't even flex and act like I'm not gonna do it but that's my update. We're gonna drop her off and then, I don't know, the next time y'all see me, I may be crying, who knows? <laughs> but yeah. All right, guys, it is much later. I did, or we did drop off. I came straight home, Will went to work. Um, I came home and literally got right to it. I've been working from home. Um, I was working in the bed for quite a bit, but I got up for a lunch break. I have some pasta going on the stove right now. I just wanted to check in and say, drop off went so well. She was instantly like smiling and like, just looking around at the classroom looking at the kids like she just was so cute smiling at the teacher she didn't cry i'm not even joking i've checked into the camera system it literally says that i've logged on 20 times today so <laughs> um i have no shame i have checked that camera 20 times but it's worth it just like looking on there and seeing that she's not crying like she's holding her own bottle um, the other little kids are just like looking at her. She was like playing with her feet. I saw that she had a blowout. They changed her clothes. <laughs> so yeah, I just wanted to do a quick check and let y'all know that I did not have a nervous breakdown. I'm fine. I'm actually happy a little bit that like I've been able to do some work. Like I'm proud of myself for not just sitting around like moping around all day. So it's about three o'clock right now. I'm gonna finish up this last, like I have literally two bullet points left in this like long analysis that I had to do. So I'm very happy that that's gonna be done in just a second. I'm gonna upload that and then I'm gonna, I need to run like to two stores. And then I did a drop off to this like children's like resale store, just getting rid of some stuff of Jordan's that um, we couldn't have anymore and I don't have anyone to like just give the clothes to because the clothes were like Given to me from like my sister my best friend. So um, Just things that we literally don't have room for and I hate just throwing things away and then um, Whatever like the people won't take I I know I can find someone to like donate the stuff to but she had a lot of stuff like brand new with tags on that I had just bought that of course she grew out of so I wanted to at least try to get some money back because it is time to buy her like the next size stuff up. So I'm um, gonna pick up the stuff from there. Um, I have some returns to Walmart. So I'm not gonna lie, it is gonna be nice to run around and do my errands and not have to like lug your car seat in and out because honestly, sometimes like that thought of like, okay, I have to get up, get myself fully ready, get my daughter fully ready, like, carry her seat around connected to the stroller so on and so forth like is the reason that i just stay my butt at home and i'm like bro like i'm just gonna chill at home so i'm happy to have a little bit of mommy time today to be able to get my work done and yeah like but yeah i'll check in later after i eat my lunch probably when i'm heading out to do my errands but that's just my little check-in for now i am alive i'm well i'm thriving jordan is thriving will is always starving he went to work <laughs> but yeah <laughs>